Hello and welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about write a program in C++ to find the greatest common divisor of given two natural numbers. So, let us first understand what do you mean by GCD. GCD stands for greatest common divisor. Suppose the two numbers are 2 and 8. So, the greatest common divisor for both the numbers are 2. Okay. Suppose the number is 8 and 25. So in this case, the greatest common divisor for both the numbers. Actually, the process is very simple to find out. We have to the actually the process is very simple. We have to list the divisors for the given number. That is one, two, uh, four, and eight. And for twenty-five, the divisors are one, five, and twenty-five. So you can notice that common divisors in both the cases are only one. So the greatest common divisor for 8 and 25 is 8 and 25 is 1 okay so based upon this two example this question we will be solving this question and we will try to answer the solution of this okay so let us start see out we need two numbers so enter two numbers in A, C in B. Now we will declare int A, comma B. These are the two numbers that we want. And uh, there is one logic that I uh, will be using to find out the greatest common divisor. I will be subtracting the number from uh, the smaller number from the greatest number and uh, till both the numbers are equal. I will explain the logic here. Suppose the numbers are 8 and uh, to 25. So in this in this case, first I will be comparing whether A is greater than B. Suppose A is 8 and B is 25. So I will be comparing if A is greater than B. So A is greater than B. So A is not greater than B. In this case, I will be subtracting uh, 8 from 25. So the answer and storing the answer in B. So the value of B will become the value of b will become 25 minus 8 that is uh, 17 okay then again i will be checking whether uh, a and b uh, which one is greater so again b is greater so i will be subtracting a from b that is 17 minus 8 that is 9 uh, again b is greater so again i will be subtracting that is b equals to b equals to 17 9 minus 8 that is 1 then Okay, now I will be subtracting A. Now I will be subtracting B from A. That is A equals to 7. A equals to 7. Then A equals to 6. Then A equals to 5. Then A equals to 4. Then A equals to 3. You are getting, I am subtracting 1 each time because the value of b is 1. a equals to 2 and finally a equals to 2 minus 1, 1. Now both the values of a and b are equal. So, gcd is 1. Okay. I hope you understood the logic. We will be using this same logic in while loop. While a does not equals to b simple if if a is greater than b a equals to a minus b else b equals to b minus a okay and finally i'll be printing c out the gcd is gcd is c out a either you print a or b both the values are equal so you can print either a or b here it is 2 okay so let me execute this program
okay so first example was 2 and 8 so 2 was first number 8 is the second number the GCD is 2 perfect okay here it was 2 and 8 2 then we will take another example that is 8 and 25 so 8 and 25 it is 1 perfect so our logic is working perfectly fine so this was a complete program to demonstrate the GCD of the given two numbers if you have any doubt in this particular program you can post that doubt in the comment besides that if you have any other question for me to solve then you can post the question in the comment I will try to answer it as soon as possible thank you for listening all the best for your exam and have a great day